Hi, Bay fans. This is a supermarket beer from Northern Monk. This is their Lucy Ketchin IPA. Now, I do find, as a lot of people do, it's not just me, Northern Monk a little bit hit and miss. So I'm interested to try this one. Hi there, everybody. Welcome to Andy's Beer Reviews. Yes, this is Lucy Ketchin IPA from Northern Monk with 6.5% ABV. Interested to try this one because... Um, I have a love-hate relationship, as a lot of people do, actually, with, with Northern Monk beers in supermarkets. The stuff in bottle shops is usually phenomenal, uh, but supermarkets, a little bit hit and miss. I understand some of the reasons why there is. Um, but I've had their Cosmic Fog recently, and that was really nice. So I'm kind of hoping this is another good one, and then maybe turning a little bit of a corner. Um, Lucy is a Yorkshire artist. I think she might actually be a Leeds-based artist. I um, should really show you that one, shouldn't I? Um, known for her bold, colourful statements in the, the art she produces. Um, so bizarrely, if the brand works correctly, I'm expecting this to be the same from Northern Monk. I'm expecting this to be quite a bold statement piece. I'm expecting something quite punchy. We'll see, won't we? Um, buy some Sainsbury's, pay £3.50 for this one so it's not an expensive ipa which always puts me on the back foot anyway if i'm being brutally honest but it's poured actually a really nice color that's poured some lovely aromas on that as well um some it's poured a really bright vivid hazy orange with a lovely supposed to be a creamy head i've got some large bubbles in there but that head looks really creamy there's a lot i would guess of oats in this one that's and i'm guessing wheat as well because that's got i think reckon that head i have a little bit of retention to it um it looks good let's get the nose in there let's see what it smells like shall we Ooh. Smells good. It's got a really juicy, mouth-watering orange aroma. Do you know what this reminds me of? When I was a youngster, my grandparents always bought Cure Orange. Best orange you could buy back in the day, a dilute, and it's, it's that. Really concentrated orange aroma it's pithy it's zesty it's sweet oh i think i might like this one so far so good right let's uh, let's try it cheers everybody They've only gone and done it again. That, from Northern Monk, is a really, really decent beer. That is, that for £3.50. Let's see what it says it's got in it. Don't say flavorings. Bottom off barley, wheat, oats, hops, and yeast. No flavors. Nice one. It's if there's no fla no flavorings in there, that is a very well hopped beer. It's zingy. It's orangey. I'm perhaps picking up a little bit of mango, a little bit of pineapple, but it's the orange flavour that's really coming to the to the front. Um, a nice low to mid bitterness on the back end. It's that sort of not quite middle, um, not quite medium, but it's getting up towards a medium bitterness. Really nice. And getting a little bit of um, 
don't know how people always take it when I describe it, but a vegetile flavour, like a really green, hoppy, um, I always say cabbage and it's not right to call it cabbage but really green, hoppy flavour, getting that around the back of my mouth. I love that flavour in, in IPAs. Uh, Verdant do it all the time. It's one of their signature flavours. And for me, ah, I just love it. Um, and on the back end, a little bit floral coming through. Sweetness. And that bitterness is lasting as well. It is a well-made beer. Now, this is from part of their uh, Faith in Futures range, and it's their, like, um, charitable foundation. So I don't think it's money from here. I think they're, they're raising money through special events and that sort of thing. Uh, but a little bit of this might go into the, into the foundation, but oh, each can sell this beer includes a donation to our Faith for Futures Foundation. But I know they do lots of special launches and special beers and that sort of thing, and, and I know that goes into it. So a little bit of money's gone into the foundation as well from, from purchasing that. Now, first thing I'm going to do, first thing I'm going to do tomorrow, tomorrow lunchtime, is nip to my, my local Sainsbury's. I bought this at White Rose, Centre, White Rose Centre in Leeds. So I'm hoping the one near when I work in Donny um, has got this in because that is a cracking beer. Um, it's creamy, it's smooth, it's fruity, it is tasty. It lacks a little bit in a little bit of punch. I'd like that orange flavour to continue a little bit more. That's just me personally. Um, but for me, it's a, I, I thought Cosmic Fog was going to be their beer, supermarket beer of the year, this year. But this is very nice indeed. Well done, Northern Monk. Hopefully, this means you're turning a corner. Uh, I don't have any more Northern Monk. To drink, I don't think. This is a shame. I have to track a few more down, a supermarket ones down, uh, just see what they're like. Um, but yeah, I think they turned the corner. I think the last couple of had have been really good, so I'm hoping that's it. If any of you guys have tried this, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Like to see them. I have been a little bit behind in the comments, but I think I'm now um, up to date. Um, so yes, yeah, so until next time, everybody. I think Scotty did I? Um, score wise, eight and a half out of ten. Eight and a half out of ten from Andy's beer views. But it's time. Um, until next time, everybody, enjoy your beers. Cheers. <laughs>